Hey guys, Poppy here. And today I want to share with you my experience when I was trying to make a cake. This is my first time working with fondant, second cake in my life. I haven't made any cakes before. Uh, the dough I was making is just a simple vanilla dough, there's nothing special about it. And uh, I bought some pre-made fondant, colored fondant, and then I wanted to make um, my own fondant from marshmallows. Let's just put it in the oven and leave it there to bake. The cream I made was from the curd and the whipped cream. Just put it all together and then, yeah, there is the whipped cream. <laughs> I used two types of marshmallows. The smaller ones, uh, when I added water and left it in microwave for 30 seconds, made this nyaffy fluffy uh, thing. And then I added the icing sugar, I think it's called. And I was adding sugar more and more until the until it wasn't thick enough to make the fondant. It was actually a lot of sugar. It surprised me how much sugar you need to add to make this fondant. Then I took the bigger marshmallows, but after 30 seconds they were just just a little bit squishy. So I added them into the microwave oven for 10 more seconds, and then they made the this this uh, material so I could add uh, sh icing sugar again and then I, uh, I've i made like two homemade fondants that I can work with the with the bigger ones they uh, returned into the like uh, consistency of the marshmallow so it was harder to work with them so I would recommend to use the smaller ones for the homemade Fondant. Now with the cake, I split it into three parts and I covered all parts with cream, uh, and then I covered the top and the and the sides of the uh, of the cake as well. I wanted to make it perfect, just perfectly round. I uh, because I've heard that the fondant is very unforgiving and everything you leave there, it's gonna show on the fondant. I don't have any fancy rotating knives stuff i don't know so i've spent a lot of time just to trying to make it as perfect as i can with normal kitchen stuff you know and i think it actually looks pretty good now so i left it in the fridge to sit for a while and then i was working with the fondant so i used icing sugar on my hands so the fondant wouldn't be sticky and i put together blue and black fondant because i had the idea to make something in the sea well like in every with everything in life i didn't know what am i doing right now <laughs> i've made a flat like a circle and i've seen a video how to get the sugar off you know brush it off like this so it's not working it's still there pew, 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 pew. God damn it. Beep, 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 beep. And then the fondant started to tear apart, so I stopped and I just decided to put it on a cake. I didn't know how, I just wanted to. I, I, I just grabbed it and put it on the cake. Uh, it worked surprisingly well. Then I was trying to just like smooth it up. I, don't, I didn't have any tools, I still don't have any tools, so I was just using my hands and I was just putting it all together uh, oh no there is a small gap no 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 one sees it no 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 the cake is perfect just 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 yeah hide it like this great and i uh cut off all the parts that were too much on the edges i didn't like how curvy is the end of the cake so i used the uh, yellow fondant and I got the white fondant I made this one is from the bigger marshmallows so you can see it's just like getting back together and it's more like more likely to tear apart so it was harder to work with it but I've made this like twisted uh, drink and I put it around the cake perfect now it occurred to me that the cake is really dark so maybe not see maybe it's gonna be a space 
so I made this astronaut and I wanted to put it on the cake but it didn't stick so what to do so I thought water is the solution you know and I used a lot of water I thought it will just dry out it took like three days to dry dry out so that's too much water you don't need so much water but I've had the idea what how to make my cake because hey who turned out the light hey who turned out the light hey who turned out the light so then I added Tardis and I've made some more stars and planets and I used a lot of water oh my god you see the the cake is shining but you know everything sticked very well together <laughs> And it was delicious, so yay! Doctor Who cake.